And guys, this is one of the top brands. They're not quite as known in the US as they are in Europe, but if you're looking for something that's a Yagi, you're looking for something that you want to do portable, or maybe you're getting into contesting, sure. it's probably great for, um, great for contesting. This is I'm James, November Zero Whiskey Radio Lima, and I'm here with... Alessandra from Momo Bean. Alessandra from Momo Bean, and we are super excited that you guys came all the way from Italy to join us at the Hamfest here in Dayton. How are you liking the event so far? The, the event is amazing, it's so big. We went to Florida last year, but this is much, much bigger, so much fun. So many people came here, and we are really happy. Nice, nice. And so what are you guys showing off today? Are you just kind of giving a general overview of your different products? Like Yeah, yeah, exactly. We are an Italian brand from Sicily, actually. Uh, we make uh, Yagi antennas, uh, and uh, this is just a display of uh, how our antennas are made. So we, made, I mean, we make uh, a portable antenna, and also uh, much bigger antennas. The difference is uh, in uh, the boom actually, uh, because portable antennas have square boom and they're very easy to uh, do and do also with the um, hardware, because we also supply the the ones that uh, they're very easy to unscrew. But the, nice. the uh, standard antennas, uh, they are made with a um, uh, square boom, uh, with uh, plates, counter plates. Uh, this uh, uh, hardware is uh, all, um, all steel. And, uh, this plastic stuff uh, is uh, uh, UV resistant, so they're made nice. to last. Made to last. That's amazing though too, because I don't think a lot of people know that Momo Bean, if you want to get something portable like this yeah. for Poda, Field Day, all this sort of thing, that Momo Bean has that. And guys, this is one of the top brands. They're not quite as known in the US as they are in Europe, but if you're looking for something that's a Yagi, you're looking for something that you want to do portable, or maybe you're getting into contesting, sure. It's probably great for um, it's great for contesting. And since you're from Italy, I have to say, I have to ask, how do you say ham radio in Italian? How do we say ham radio? Um, I, I think we say ham radio, but uh, the ham radio people are radiamatori. So. Radio matori. Si. <laughs> radio matori. Okay, I learned uh, I learned at least one uh, word in Italian today. So radio yeah. matori. And you have to use hands. Oh, you have to use hands. <laughs> okay, and what would you say like? Um, do you have any like most popular Momo Beam antennas? Like if I was looking for, hey, I just want a really good Mo, uh, Momo Bean Yagi, what would you recommend starting? Well, if you are looking for like an all-around antenna that maybe uh, goes on multiple frequencies, I would definitely recommend the Penta 10. Uh, the Penta 10? Yeah, it has 10 elements, two elements for each band, so it wow. goes from 10 meters up to 20 meters, and it has uh, work bands in the middle. Very compact, because the boom is only 3.9 meters, so it's very compact, and uh, it's very easy to install like uh, all the mobile antennas and I would start with that because you you have a lot of um, frequencies to work on so it's only one fed point so it's perfect to start yeah that's perfect you get all your work bands you have 10 meter to 20 meter and 20 meter I mean you can do so much with and it, something that's gonna do 10 to 20 meter you can do a lot of operations with that yeah. um, what else would you recommend that we take a look at it says you have mono band dual yeah. band Tri band, quad band, band five band, five I mean, bands. all the way up to five bands. Yeah, of course. And uh, pre previously, I showed you this is like uh, how regular antennas are made, so this kind of boom. But when we go to bigger antennas, this is how they're made. Wow. So this is like a boom for bigger antennas, maybe the That's ones... incredible construction. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this is steel, uh, so it's very um, trustworthy, you know? Right. And um, again, very easy to install because, sorry, uh, because we put um, stickers on uh, each part of the antenna. So you know with color and uh, with what it's written uh, where things go. So always showing us. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get a live demo here. I love this. <laughs> this is these are so nice, guys. These are nice. Thank you. Uh, I, I love that you. Yeah, the stickers. A lot of people don't realize that, but actually having the things that help you construct yeah. it makes a big difference. A lot less errors and questions and you know if you can just stick it right together when it arrives that makes it a lot easier. Yeah, something that we are very proud of is that uh, you can almost assemble our antennas without the manual. It's that easy. Wow. So you just plug and then uh, you screw it and back you screw it in. and uh, it's very sturdy. Wow we're like actually we're building this live now so now <laughs> we're actually building antennas. Okay. 
And as I said, all the hardware is uh, stainless steel. And so what about like shipping to the um, shipping to the U.S.? How does that work? And if they order it on the um, Mobile Beam uh, website and everything, you guys ship to the U.S.? Yeah, of course. You can order on the Mobile Beam website and we can uh, get ship it to you. But we also sell through uh, HRO in the U.S. Okay. So you find a, a selection of products. Um, next week, uh, yeah, when they are restocking, so you will find uh, everything fresh from uh, from Sicily. So and yeah, I'm actually in the in the market right now. I've been operating with like a dipole wire antenna, so I'm in the market to get my first Yagi. So this might actually be very good for me. Yeah. Um, but I just got to decide if I want to get something that's um, maybe a little bit more porta portable, like mm -hmm. the Poda and Field Day, or if I want to go ahead and get something that's a little bit more permanent and a little yeah. bit more sturdy. But I guess if you went with this. I mean, it's portable, but you can still put it on a tower and you can still use it just of the same, course, right? Of course you can. Yeah. Now, what is this? Oh, we also make uh, uh, wire antennas. So it's a kind of a new product. Uh, we make uh, wire antennas that can handle uh, a lot of power, actually, uh, because like we are really interested in making uh, um, high quality solutions. That's awesome. And you can see they mark it here so yeah. you can see which one. So this is going to be our 10, 15, 20 and 40. Exactly. Yep. And we can supply you this plate here so that's easier to uh, assemble it to the pole. So. Well, thank you so much. Uh, anything else that you think people should know about with uh, Momo Beam in tennis or that we cover most of it? I think we really covered most of it. I don't know if um, you need something special. Maybe you need a special design, something that you have in mind but couldn't find it on the market. Please uh, tell us and we will uh, design for you. We um, make a lot of custom projects, so awesome. feel free to uh, well, write have to get a it. custom World Radio League uh, antenna next. That's oh, yeah. that's sure. this. Um, are you guys going to be at the German Camp Fest? Yeah. We'll yeah. be there there. So when in Germany, since I made you do an interview in uh, English when we go to Germany, you interview me, I'll do it in Italian. Okay, okay, okay we can do this. Okay, <laughs> thank, thank you, you so much. much. We've helped over 60,000 students get their US FCC amateur radio license, and we can help you too, no matter your age or educational background. Go to www.hamradioprep.com and try a free lesson today.